Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. Today we will check uh, the new files which I downloaded from Kaggle. I downloaded the data from Mr. App and Paint. The data is about deliveries. So let's start and see what we can find in this data. So on the left, on the left side, we can see uh, purchase, or purchase order and sales order number. Then we have country. We have uh, in quote terms uh, type, in quote terms name, shipping modes, related date for these particular lines and a category group. I will guess that this is one of the most uh, sim most common data sets for uh, delivery data. But today we'll focus more about the costs and I want to show you today four columns and four KPIs, which I think that they are pretty common for supply chain department, supply chain analysis department. So on this side, we are seeing that we have, here we have costs and prices. And I marked, uh, my, I marked yellow these four columns. And let's start from the beginning, cost per kg. Usually on each dashboard or data set, we are calculating cost per kg for some category group. Here you can find that there, I use here uh, if a condition with is text. So basically how it's working is checking if in freight cost is uh, text or no, and then divided it by wave. And this I make for all of the lines. Total cost is working pretty similar. So when it's uh, text in freight cost, it's not adding it. But if not, it's adding line item insurance, freight cost, and pack price. Total price is even more simple because it's multiplying line item quantity by line item value. And the next one, and I think the most important for each of the companies, so revenue. And revenue is um, total price minus total cost. And that's it for today. So these four columns with these KPIs. Thank you for watching.